Hello everyone, it's me JB from Unique Tutorials. Today, in this video, I will show you how to know which type of files the unknown file with no extension belongs in Windows, Mac and Linux. So without further more delay, let's begin. So right now you can see on my Windows computer desktop screen, you can see I have two files name with the name file and installer. So let us check its properties. So you can see the type of the file is written file so I can't find it exactly what file it is. It is whether a document file or some movie files or music files. So I am unable to find out right. So let us check its second file properties too. So still the same so we can check any type of file. So you can see here this a uh, file written type of file is a file so it's very difficult for us what files are this unknown files right so for this i will show you two methods the first method which i'm going to show you is an online method and the second method which i will show in the latter part of this video is an offline method so using an online method just you need to open any web browser and in the google search just search for the link that is a toolslay file identifier and after typing or searching this in the google search you will see its website so you can see uh, identify unknown files instantly just open this now it will show you to drag and drop a file here or you can just click on select a file so let me just drag and drop so let me drag and drop this first file so you can see here it's showing a text file so it's a text file that means if it's a text file i can definitely open with any text editor or text viewer say let us try to open this with a notepad so let me drag it voila it's really a text file right that means the first file is a document or a text file right so this really gonna works right and so now let us try with the offline method so once again just open any web browser firstly and in the google search just search for the application name as droid and you will see a tons of website just scroll down below till the bottom and you will see a website written with a github.com right so you can see a droid this tell record and object identification just click on this link which is shown along with the github.com right just open this now scroll down below you will see some instructions if you want to read some instructions like Linux OS OS X that is a Mac OS or the Windows users so you can download from here also some links are given for you or some instructions but I will recommend to go to this releases and just scroll down below And now you can see just below the assets you can see here our uh, zip files that is a uh, first is with a jre that is with the java and one is dot zip so i'll highly recommend if you're using a uh, windows computer i'll highly recommend you to download this win32 firstly so let me download this so it's starting to download so wait for a few seconds until the complete downloading of this file is completed so the file has been downloaded so let me go to the folder where it's being downloaded and let me close this web browser so since it's a zip file just double up click it to extract this file so now you will see your folder just open it now under the folder you will see a tons of files right so here you can see one file name as droid dot pet just right click on it and just run as administrator wait for a few seconds so it's contacting the updated server so it's already detected that there is a newer version so just update it wait for a few more seconds until the server gets updated
so finally the updated version has been successfully installed so let me click on ok now you can use your applications offline so wait for a few more seconds it's initializing profile so wait for a few more seconds so now you're ready to use this software so now what you need to do is you can see here add button right just click on add and now locate to your location so in my case it's in the desktop say I want to check about this say I want to check about this installer what file it is right so I'll just select this and I'll just click on OK and I have selected this file and now to find out what file this unknown file is just select this and click on start here so you can see here it's showing a windows portable executable file that means it's a exe file that is an installer file so you can see some more information about the versions that it is a 32-bit software and it's a executable file that means it's a exe file so now i can confirm by finding both the file types that is the first file it's a text file so what I will do let us give a extension name with since it's a text file so let me try using a txt and let me try to open it yes it's a text file the first one and let us check if it's a really a exe file or not let me type really it's a exe file so using these two methods you can easily know which type of files the unknown file with no extension belongs in your respective windows mac and linux computer so if you never known about the school tricks then definitely you should try it out and if you find this video tutorial useful please click on the thumbs like button and if you're new to our channel click on the subscribe button and lastly thanks for watching